Hi everyone, welcome back. So I know it's been a really long time since I filmed a video, and I promised I was going to be better through December, but I had to face some pretty harsh realities when it comes to this channel this month. And when it comes down to it, making the beauty videos isn't making me happy right now. I'm not going to say the beauty videos are going to be gone from this channel forever, but for right now, with everything that's going on in the beauty channel community, people razzing on each other and the horrible, horrible things that people are calling each other, I just don't feel like I can participate and be part of that right now. So for now, beauty channel, sorry, beauty videos will be far and few between from me. In the meantime, what's going to happen to this channel? There's another update I need to give you all, and that's something my husband and I have been talking about um, over the last while, and that's another reason why a lot of the videos have slowed down. When it comes to our infertility journey, we're going to take a year off. We're not going to go talk to fertility doctors or anything like that yet. We're going to give it another year. We want to keep trying on our own a while longer. But in that year, what we're going to do is focus on saving up money because fertility treatments are expensive and we want to take that time to focus on our health. So focusing on my health is a lot of what this channel is going to be switching to. Starting on Friday, I'm going to be doing weekly check-ins for things going on with me losing weight. My goal this next year is to lose a pound a week which is very realistic, likely to stay off kind of a situation. You know, initially in the beginning, water weight comes off, so a lot will probably come off in the beginning. But after that, my goal is to lose a pound a week. And to do that, I need to be accountable to somebody outside of my own home. I can't afford a personal trainer, all those kind of things, because we're trying to save up so that we can have our children soon. And so while we're trying on our own, the goal is to lose weight. So that's what my focus on this channel is going to be for the next while. Eventually beauty channels or beauty videos might work their way back in. But for now, my focus is going to be the weekly weight loss check-ins. As of this morning, I got on the scale and it was 265 pounds. That's way too heavy for my tiny 5'2 frame. And that's just me getting real with you guys. I don't want pity or anything, I've done this to myself. And with my PCOS, um, when Steve and I first got married, I gained a lot of weight really fast. And I haven't really gained a ton this year, but I have gained some. So the goal at this point is to basically lose everything I've gained since we got married. That's the primary focus for me. Because in doing so, that would put me back at a place where it's healthier, I would feel more comfortable going on fertility drugs, because a lot of times those can cause you to gain weight. So that's the first goal. If I can go past that, I'd like to get under 200. Like I say, the only goal for this year is to lose a pound a week. So that's 52 pounds from where I'm at, which would put me a lot closer to 200 pounds, which would make me initially feel a lot more comfortable. So that's primary goal number one. Next question is probably, how are you going to achieve this, Shayla? Well, here's my answer for that. So since I don't have a treadmill or anything like that, we have an exercise bike, which I'm probably going to be pulling in the house. Right now it's in the garage. So I'll give that a good clean off and bring it in the house and start using that on occasion. But most of what I'm going to be doing is just making myself move more. I notice, especially on days off and days that I'm home, I'm not moving around a lot. I'm sitting and reading or sitting and watching a TV show. I'm not getting up and moving. So my cute friend Carrie sent me this link where it's two like cups with popsicle sticks and one is a one cup has get off your butt and so there's a bunch of different things in the cup for you to pull out and do and then you put that in the done cup and the goal is to do five of those every day. And I've also found some YouTube videos that are some workouts and some things like that. So I'll be incorporating a lot of those things in. Mostly what I'll be focusing on is diet. Um, in the last year, I haven't really tried outside of, you know, the first month or two of 2015. I haven't really focused on what I was eating at all. I just kind of ate what I wanted, tried to not overeat, 
things like that. But, you know, when you're eating nothing but Mexican food every other day, it, you put on weight. It's just reality. Especially when you have something like PCOS where you are prone to gaining weight. And I already know that I'm that way. So... A lot of what I'm going to be doing is incorporating a lot more green veg in my diet. I've always struggled with this. You can ask my parents. They couldn't even get me to eat any vegetables really outside of green beans most of my growing up years. But as I've gotten older, I've started to eat more vegetables and things like that. And so that's a lot of what my focus is going to be, is incorporating healthier things into my diet and watching my portion control. Um... My portion control has gotten a little insane lately. I'm trying to be better at that. So this week is mostly going to be me focusing on diet. Um, starting next Monday, a week from today, um, is when the heavy workout stuff is going to be um, put into play. So it gives me time to get set up, things like that. I am still going to do a check-in on Friday to see if any weight has come off with the changes in diet. I'm hoping it has. Um, today so far, um, what I've, I've created a brand new MyFitnessPal because the one I had before said I'd gained 58 pounds and that was super depressing. And so I went and I made a brand new account because I'm starting fresh, I'm starting new, I don't want that past hanging over me. And so from there, I'm starting fresh. So I will still do a check-in Friday. I will actually do my measurements Friday. I didn't do measurements this morning. So measurements will start as of Friday. So Friday you will get a weigh-in, measurements, how I'm feeling, how much water I'm drinking, things like that. So that's kind of what those videos will be. They'll mostly just be check-ins. If I feel like I've been doing something really cool, then I'll add those to the videos. I might kind of slowly vlog throughout the week. I'm still kind of trying to figure out exactly how these videos are going to work best. Um, I've got some friends that have decided to kind of pal up with me and I'll be able to go and do some workouts with them. So I might, you know, take the camera along with me, shoot a little intro before, shoot after, talking about what we did. I'm not 100% sure yet. It's all still kind of floating around. And I'm going to take a lot of this week to solidify that. In the meantime, come be friends with me on my fitness pal. I'd love to have you along for the ride. And... That's really all I wanted to come on here and say because this channel isn't going to die. It's just going to change. Um, again, like I said with the beauty videos, um, so many of the big beauty YouTubers like are getting lamb blasted left and right. And now the people that are commenting are getting lamb blasted by other people as well. And I just want to avoid that negativity and toxicity. And, you know, me putting myself out there in this way... Yeah, I'm going to expect people to come at me and tell me that I'm fat or I'm ugly or things like that. Even though I know that I'm not those things. I know I'm unhealthy right now and that I want to change that. And so that's what I'm doing. And if you're going to land blast me for making changes, that's your problem and your issue. But the fact of the matter is, is I have to do what's best for me and I need to feel accountable to someone. So my accountability is going to be to the people that follow me on my fitness pal and to you guys and to anybody else who feels like they want to be on this journey with me. So I invite you all to come along. I hope with all of my heart that you can support me in this decision and that I will see you guys around. Have a nice one. See you Friday. Bye.